Good evening, everybody. I'm C.J. Ward. And I'm Beth Farnsworth. Our top story at 5, an alarming discovery in Ventura County. Thousands of fish found dead in the J Street drainage canal on the border of Oxnard and Port Wyneme. News Channel 3's Kelsey Gerkins joins us live from Port Wyneme. And Kelsey, at this point, it's a mystery. Yeah, that's right, Beth and CJ. I just spoke with a biologist that's getting water samples from this drainage culvert, and he tells me at this time it is unclear exactly why there are thousands of dead fish here. Now, the most alarming news about this is there is at least nine different species of dead fish here, including saltwater as well as freshwater fish. Now, residents first reported the dead fish yesterday, and they noticed a large amount of fish of all sizes is stuck in the Mature County Watershed Protection District drain near Wanyimi Road and J Street. By this morning, crews were at the drain cleaning up the dead fish and rescuing the ones that were still alive. While it is still unclear where the fish came from, several local residents are believing one theory, that water levels rose during the weekend storms and then dropped suddenly, sending the fish from the Ormond Beach Lagoon to the drain and then stranding them there. Looks like thousands because there's small fish, there's huge fish, and it, there's no water on this side, but that water is full, so it looks like it's clogging the water from coming through. I've never smelled anything like this before. The smell of the dead fish is noticeable for a good half mile around the drain. And while the area is fenced off, kids are still sneaking around the fence to check out the dead fish against the wishes of county authorities. And biologists tell me that the endangered goby fish, there were a few of them found in here, but thankfully the ones that they found were alive and they were able to rescue them. Now crews have left at this point, but they are expected to be out here again tomorrow morning along with biologists trying to figure out exactly what caused these thousands of fish to wash up dead here. Reporting live in Port Wyneme, Kelsey Gerkins, News Channel 3. All right, thank you, Kelsey. Santa Barbara